Hello and welcome to this Ytex video about All-American Calf Tag application. Before we start on the application, I'm going to show you the products that we're going to use today. To tag a calf, we're going to use All-American three star tags. Our calf tag size is three star, so you'll want to look for the three star symbol on the neck of the tag. And then it's very important to use the correct tagger with the tag that you're using. Same, same tag, same brand tagger. So if we're using all American tags, we want to use the Ytex Ultra Tagger Compact or the Ytex Ultra Tagger Plus. This is the Ultra Tagger Compact. <laughs> Has a quick release pin, so you don't have to open the handles to release it from the ear tag. Today we're going to use the Ultra Tagger Plus, the blue tagger. Show you how to load that with our three star All American tag. The three star tag, that goes face down into the tagger. Your button loads onto the pin. You will hear it pop onto the pin when it's securely latched. Before we get our live calf, I want to demonstrate tagging on my cardboard leather ear here. I want to show you proper placement. We've got cartilage running on the top and the bottom. We don't want to place the tag there. The blue represents arteries in the ear. The red represents a large vessel that runs through the ear. My stars indicate where the identification tag needs to go, either below or above that large vein. A newborn calf's ear is very flimsy. So when tagging the ear, we want to make sure that we hold, hold the ear tight or taunt. I'm going to show you if we don't hold it tight, we drag a lot of tissue into that hole as we're piercing it. But if we can hold that ear very tight and we tag the calf, we make a much smaller hole easier to heal. So let's go grab our calf. Inside her ear we can see the cartilage and the vessels. So essentially we gotta shoot for here or here with our hole, above or below this main vessel. Our tagger gun, the button goes in the back. So again, we're gonna hold this ear nice and tight you can feel with your fingers where that cartilage and veins at. Right there and squeeze your trigger handles and pull your gun out. You may need to rotate the tag down just a little bit. But there you go. 